Your gods are weak, Inquisitor! You will see the power of Hakon when we destroy the Lowlands! The fortress is too well defended. We must find another way in. The Avar at Stone Bearhold may have ideas. When you are ready, you have our blades, Inquisitor. You said that the Jaws of Hakon first tried binding their god in mortal form hundreds of years ago. What of it? In our search for Inquisitor Emeridan, we learned that he came here to fight a great dragon 800 years ago. A dragon that came from the mountains with Avar warriors to attack the Lowlands. <sighs> Your last Inquisitor must have fought well to stop Hakon himself. You're not bothered by the idea that our Inquisitor killed your god? He didn't kill him. That would have been easier. Whatever fight your Inquisitor finished, the Jaws of Hakon started. I find no fault with a warrior defending his people. Do the Avar gods take mortal form on a regular basis? No. The gods belong in the Land of Dreams. Whether it is their wish or some augurs that brings them here, battle tears will be shed. The Skulls say the Lady of the Skies took mortal form when Tyrda Brightax first led the Avar to the mountains. They say many things about Brightax and the Lady. I will speak with you later. Farewell. When you are ready, you have our blades, Inquisitor. I'm ready to attack the Jaws of Hakon. Good. They will pay the blood price for what they have done. Your Skald and your Scout are here. We can plan the assault. Oh, I like the sound of Skald. It's more dramatic than Professor. <coughs> <coughs> yes, well, uh, everything we've found out about Inquisitor Emeridan suggests that he never emerged from that Tevinter fortress. If that is where your Inquisitor defeated Hakon, that is where the Jaws of Hakon must perform the right to free him. Ideally, we stop them before that. I'd rather not fight an Avar god if we don't have to. You really have no problem with us killing your god? Gods cannot be reborn until they die. Hakon needs a good rebirthing. If you say so. With its ice wall melted, the fortress is open to attack. We must strike soon, before our foes recover. They're already trying. I've got most of our forces defending the shrine from Hakonites who want to restore the wall. If anyone has suggestions, now is the time. What gives you fear, Inquisitor? Is this not the battle you wanted? I'm no warrior, but with Lady Harding's forces defending the shrine and no way to breach the walls... <sighs> Lowlanders. Why not climb the walls? Your warriors can get over those walls before the Hakonites stop them? This is not a war, Stone Daughter. This is a raid. We strike at night. Clad lightly, we climb the wall and open the gate from inside. Agreed. How soon can we attack? As soon as the sun sets, Inquisitor. This will be a good night. Inquisition forces will feign weakness near the shrine. That'll draw some of them away from the fortress. Not too many, I hope. Yes, save some for us. Right, Inquisitor. Hask and I will climb over. I'll be there to catch Parv when he slips. Oh, 
Of course you will. You'll be behind me after all. Where the guard? I've got him. There! The war on us! Kill the Inquisitor! Death to her hold for her <laughs> Work, Stone Bear Hold. No sign of the dragon. It must be in there. <laughs> 